Coyote Country, I'm going to put a statement up here. You need to tell me whether it's savvy or silly for Coyote Country behavior. You guys ready? Yeah. Okay, here we go. I let my dog off leash to play with the coyotes every night. <laughs> silly, why? These are real statements, by the way. I'm not making these up. These are things people have actually told me, all right? So this is not safe. We all know why, okay? They're playing for a while, but eventually it's going to go badly for the dog. I thought that if I left one chicken bone out in the yard per day, the coyotes would leave the rabbits alone. <laughs> is that savvy or silly? Why? First of all, do the rabbits need to be left alone? Let's just clarify. Yeah. No. He would leave these chicken carcasses out in his yard, and the coyotes would come, and it was creating chaos throughout the entire neighborhood. I saw a coyote in my neighborhood last night, so I told all my neighbors with pets to be extra careful when they leave them outside. Seven. Love that person. Yes, give them an A. I looked up after grabbing the morning paper and saw a coyote at the end of the drive, so I threw the paper at it. Seven. Love that. It's a great way to haze. You got a paper in your hand, just throw it at the coyote. I enjoy watching coyotes in my backyard. They've been here every winter for about three years. They all have names. <laughs> this person was letting the coyote come up to this glass window and touch noses with her cat inside the house. These two coyotes had to be destroyed because this is the one, one of these coyotes was the one that was following those school children at 30 feet. So she created two coyotes that had completely inappropriate behavior. All right. They were too comfortable. All the neighbors ratted her out. <laughs> they were tired of her, OK? And then we went to her yard, and she said, there, there aren't any coyotes here. Well, I walked in the backyard, and two of them popped over the fence. So that was my first cue that she wasn't telling the truth. Last one, I would have hazed the coyote, but I was in my pajamas. I would argue most of us are probably scarier in our pajamas, so you should just go for it, OK? So, so these are all ways to test your um, coyote country savvy or silly.